Let's start designing our RDT 1.0 protocol with our first set of assumptions. For RDT 1.0, we assume that the underlying channel is completely reliable. We design the sending and receiving side FSMs. On the sending side, RDT accepts data from the upper layer. This is done through the function RDT send we previously named. Therefore, RDT send is the event for this transition. The sender makes the packet for the data and sends it using UDT send. On the receiving side, RDT receive receives a packet from the underlying channel, removes data from the packet, and passes the data to the upper layer using delivered data. The channel in this communication is perfect. Therefore, there is no additional mechanism needed to compensate for errors that might happen in transmission. 